of all wish you all very very happy navratri and i really hope this navratri will bring a lot of happiness in your life so in today's video i'll be showing you how to create this look right here i tried to keep this look really simple and so informative i shared a lot of tips and tricks to make your makeup long lasting and sweat proof so without any further ado let's get started all right you guys so i'm going to start with a moisturized face i already applied the moisturizer on my face it's a really really important step uh, before doing any kind of makeup moisturizer will hydrate and moisturize our skin really well and for that today i used this sugandha rose hip moisturizer i really love this moisturizer its texture is great and this is really good for prepping up the skin before doing makeup Next, I'm going to apply this lip balm. Uh, it's also a necessary step, especially if you are going to use matte lipstick. This step will ensure that your lips will moisturize enough to put on a matte lipstick, so your lips will not look chapped. Next, I'll be using a primer, and for that today I'm going to use Color Bar Perfect Match Primer. this one it's a silicone based primer and i really love using this because i have oily t zone it mattifies my skin and it will ensure that my makeup will stay on for a long time so if you have oily skin then you should definitely try out this primer next i'm going to use this nykaa skin shield and dye pollution foundation i love using this foundation and today i'm going to use a very little bit of this foundation um only this much of foundation for my full face because i feel less is always more in makeup the less you apply there will be more chances of it to stay as long as possible and i'm going to use beauty blender to apply this foundation i am taking this directly on my beauty blender and start applying this from the center of my face and then blend it outwards now i'll take little bit of more foundation to apply on my neck now as you can see my base looks like my skin there are some scars here and there that are showing up which i don't mind i just love when my base looks like my skin that's why i applied little bit of foundation but if you want full coverage then you can apply little bit of more foundation just don't apply layers on layers because that will not be long lasting Now I am going to use a concealer, and for that today I am going to use this Pack Takeover concealer. It's in the shade Classic Beige, and this shade is very close to my skin tone. So if you have dark circles, then always use a concealer that matches your skin tone, or maybe darker than your skin tone. And obviously, after that you can apply light shade concealer if you want to brighten up your under eye area. So now I'm gonna use very little bit of this concealer under my eyes, on my forehead area, on my nose and chin. And now I'm gonna blend it using this uh, flat top brush. patting this on where i need the more coverage now we are going to set this concealer on place and to set the cream products we need to use powder products and using a powder after applying concealer is so necessary to make it more long lasting and sweat proof and for that today i am going to use this uh, makeup revolution banana powder i am using this banana powder so it 
will brighten up my face little bit. I am just gonna use very little bit of powder. I am taking this powder on a brush. Dust of the excess. And apply it on the areas where we have applied the concealer. Okay. Let's move on to the eyebrows and to fill my eyebrows today I am going to use this Faces Canada Ultimate um, Eyebrow Pencil and I really really love using this. It's so easy to use. I am going to fill my brows very lightly using this. take little bit of brow gel on this fully and then set my brows using this and with this step our eyebrows will stay in place even after a lot of dancing and sweating all right so my brows are done now we are going to move into the eye makeup and for eye makeup today, I'll be doing cool toned eye makeup because cool toned eye makeup looks really good with silver tone jewelry. Now to prime my eyelids, I'm gonna use this spec eyeshadow primer, and I'm a, and I'm gonna apply very little bit on my eyelids. my very new palette it's the Nykaa 10 in 1 eyeshadow palette in pencil twilight and I'm really excited about this so let's see how this one works I'm gonna take this deep gray shade dust of the excess and carve out my crease using this in the inner and outer corner of my eyes Also applying it on my lower lash line. Now I am going to take this blue shimmery shade on my finger and apply it right in the center of my eye. And also blend it using your finger with the gray shade. So you can also use a brush. Now for my eyeliner, I am going to use this Maybelline Gel Eyeliner and I am going to create a very small wing. Now I am going to use this same gel eyeliner uh, as my kajal. Next, I am going to curl my eyelashes and apply some mascara. And for mascara, I am using this Maybelline Hyper Curl Mascara. And this is not a waterproof mascara. You need to apply waterproof mascara if you want it to be very long lasting. Now to add some structure to my face, I am going to use this K by Katrina Contour Stick. And it's in the shade uh, Coco Focus. I'm going to apply it right over my cheekbone, on my jawline, on my forehead and on my nose. Apply it on my nose. 
I'm gonna take a little bit on my finger and then apply it. And then I'm gonna apply some blush right over where I did the contouring and for blush I'm gonna use this Makeup Revolution palette and I am mixing both of these shades, dust of the excess, and then apply it right. And for highlighter, I am going to use these two shades. set my makeup using a setting spray and I am using this NYX matte finish on a setting and now for my lips I want something which is very long lasting and so I am gonna use this NYX professional makeup soft matte lip cream um, and it's in the shade Los Angeles so my makeup is almost done and now I will wear my jewelry and be right back. that's it for today's video guys i really hope you guys find this video helpful and if you did then don't forget to hit the like button and also subscribe to my channel i really appreciate that and i will see you guys in my next one till then stay positive spread positivity and take care of yourself bye